Hello Guardians, welcome back to Right Way Gaming. I've been away for a few days now but I'm back to it and ready to play. Today is a weekly reset for Destiny 2 as most of you will already know. So today I'm just going to take you through the milestones and what is happening out there. So if we bring up my milestones, today's Crucible challenge is basically complete three challenges in Crucible for your daily. Uh, the flashpoint is on Titan, as you can see there, to get your powerful gear. The Nightfall I'll go through in a second. The Call to Arms has been reset, so grind a bit of Crucible to get more powerful gear. Clan XP is also reset, so get through Strikes, Raids, Crucible and World Activities to gain your XP there. Now Trials of the Nine says win a Trials match like it's been reset, but it hasn't as far as I'm aware, because it says runs Friday through Monday. So that says to me that it's not available, which is strange. Now, if I go to the Nightfall, we'll have a look here. And as you can see, the Nightfall is Arcadian Valley, or Exodus Crash, as you can see there. And the modifiers are Attrition. Health and Shield Regeneration is significantly impaired. Defeating enemies may create wells of light. Collect these to restore your health and charge your super. So it seems like your super shields and health won't recharge unless you kill enemies enemies to create basically what's the equivalent to health portions that lie on the ground that's what i can grab grab from that and then we have time warp anom anomalies strange anomalies have been detected in the area destroy them to release temporal energy and extend the mission timer so i think at the start of this strike there's the big beacons that go up in the air i think by going through them you will collect timers but i could be wrong because it could be throughout the entire strike for all we know so that's this week's Nightfall, guys, it could be a bit of a difficult one. I've not had to go it yet, but it could be difficult. Um, I will see you in a second because we're going to go to the Traveller and have a look what the treasure maps are from Cade. Because, well, we just don't know, do we? Alright, so as you can see, we are back at Cade 6 and the treasure maps are also, from the looks of it, on Titan. Yep, they're all on Titan. I wonder if it's ever going to get mixed up, these. Hmm, interesting. Anyway, guys, I've collected all five of them, so I am going to go and do a video now on all the locations for them for you. Get them out of the way and get them done for you. That video will be up later tonight, so keep your eyes peeled. Um, the only thing that I've got to mention last is the raid. So, if you played the raid last week, the puzzles you did were basically the pools so you'd have to stop the bathers get into the pools and um, then destroy all the lanterns holding the poison and then it was dogs and then it was the gauntlet this week it is in fact the dogs first then the gauntlet then the pools and then the boss so from the looks of it we will be getting a weekly raid rotation in terms of the puzzles that we have to do. Who knows, there could even be another puzzle that we haven't done yet because of the simple fact that they can rotate them like this. So I'm looking forward to see what that brings and that could be just causing speculation, but you never know. Hope you enjoyed watching and don't forget to subscribe for more.